I'm sure we all know that plastic waste is a major global problem. But exactly how big? Well, let's break this one down. First of all, the global production of new plastic has now reached levels of almost 500 million metric tons per year. That doesn't necessarily say much, but let's compare it to something. When you, for example, look at the combined weight of every single human being on the planet, which is about 350 million metric tons, now that starts to give you an idea of the scale of the problem. In other words, you could say that in one year alone, we are globally producing more plastic than the entire weight of the humanity. What is alarming about this is that today, 95% of all of this plastic that is being produced is not recycled in any way. Only 5% of the plastic garbage that is being produced annually gets recycled at the moment. This means that 95% of all of this garbage ends up either in the landfills, getting burned, or worst of all, it leaks into our oceans. To make the matters even worse, it has been projected that the production of plastic is going to triple in the next 30 years. This is primarily due to the growth of the middle class, especially in regions such as Asia, Africa, Middle East and Latin America. People with new and additional money to be spent want to have their products and services closer to them. This means that people will no longer go to the local market to buy their products, their vegetables and fruits in a bamboo basket, for example, but instead will be buying these from the convenience stores and supermarkets where all the products are wrapped in plastic. This means that the plastic pollution problem that we are encountering around the world today is only going to get worse. We have today only scratched the surface of the problem. With the current global recycling rate of plastic being as low as 5% only, with the increase in production, this means that if we don't urgently focus into building of a global plastic waste recycling infrastructure, the 5% global recycling rate will soon become 4% and even lower. That means that we urgently need to take action to tackle this problem, otherwise we are literally going to be drowned under all of this plastic garbage.